previous video, we looked at creating a color legend for a floor plan based on room name. And as you can see here, this is the, the last floor plan that we set up. And each individual room has a separate color. But if we wanted to create something, a color legend based by department, for example, we would simply choose these rooms. So select each room. So you can either hover into your room tag and select the rooms that you want to group together. So say you wanted to group them by company type or the company department. So I'm just going to select all of rooms at this end of the building because I know for this particular company that occupy this building, they're going to want to group all of these based on the engineering department. So I'm going to group all of these. And we're going to go down to the left and we can see we've eight rooms selected and just in department, we're going to call this the engineering department. So hit return on that. Therefore, department has been applied to every single one of those rooms. So if I hit apply on that, then if I change my color scheme on my left hand side, Our scheme is by name, we want to change this to by department, so it's only the engineering department for now, we've one department, so we're going to add a second department as well. So let's click OK. So it only colors what has a department applied to it, so these only have engineering. So I'm going to choose another couple of rooms down here, I'm going to call these construction. So this is another department within the building. This doesn't alter the room names by, by any means that we created in the last video. But it simply just groups them together and we can create separate floor plans, one for room group by name and one for rooms grouped by department. So I'm going to name all of these and this is our training department. So department. So the room name is not changing whatsoever, it's only by department. We can see here department legend, engineering department and training department. Thank you.